happens today we can see a partial command called remove event log and this remove event log was used for removing a log which was created by you or which was kept by default by the system which was created by default by the system so first of all let's go to the powershell and we can just have a look about the command in detail So these are the detailed descriptions which was given for the remove event log. So as it says that it was used for deleting the event log or it was used for registering the event source. And you're gonna have a detailed description about this. So let's go to the online version. So here you can have a detailed description now uh, including the parameters also and uh, let's go to the help that is let's go to the examples here so I'm just going to remove so for this I'm just going to open my PowerShell with the elevated privileges going to give the log name as new log so before that I will open my so here I'm just going to remove this log file the name e new log so here I have just named it I'm just going to hit enter here and let's take a look on the event viewer if you see here it was removed so this is how you will use the remove event log command that is partial command to remove the logs I think this video might be helpful to you and thank you for watching the video.